in, in the local languages. So we have drama groups that go from one village to another to educate the people through songs and drama. They dramatize it with them so that people will understand. Because otherwise there was a strong denial that it doesn't exist. So, but in every division, in every village, we have a group of women that go and educate the rest of the surrounding. And every year we organize workshops for them so that they, we train them to go and sensitize people. Because women, they understand each other. So when they go and talk to each other, they, there's more consensus. Yes. The group that, was it the last village that come? Yes. That was them too, right? Yes, that's about eight. eight. Because, uh, you see, the way they were singing was very moving. Yeah. They were singing that a member of the village died. Oh. It's, in, it's, it's not a real person dying, but it's fictional. They, they characterize somebody who was very popular, very rich, but died of AIDS. To show that AIDS doesn't know status, doesn't know race, doesn't know whether you are rich or poor. And that was why they were dramatizing in such a way that the song was very moving. It was. Yes. I, I enjoyed it. Yes. program, uh -huh. adult literacy program, right. we teach them in their own la la local languages. They How to read and write? Yeah, that's it. You look at it, it's in, in the local language. And Wal the, Wallanese? Is that the local Wal? No, no. Wallanese, that is Puma. Okay. Yes. In, 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 we teach them in all languages, Mandinka, Mandinka Puma, right. Jola, Wolof. So they, they, they can write letters in, in their own languages. I gotcha. Yes. But then they cannot read, they can't understand English. But whatever you write, they can read it, but they don't know what it is. But in the, the, because, like, you, somebody trained in English reading a French text. You can read, but you don't understand what it is all about. Uh -huh. So they can read and write letters. They, they are well organized because they are saving schemes, they have credit unions. So they write on their, they keep, keep their own accounts, they have their own distinct administration, and they, they keep track of how many members they have, and how they register people, how they contribute, what they want to do. They have their own project. So we teach them to, to be able to write on their own, because what, what used to happen, men used to write for them, right. and they used to take the money and run away.